I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will try to understand how to write equation of quadratic function from graph. Question is write equation of the given parabola in standard form. So we have to write equation in standard form. So we are given a parabola here which opens downwards and there are two x intercepts. So we find that the x intercepts are at x equals to 3 and at x equals to 7. And this parabola also passes through the point P. Let's call this point P as it is 1 minus 4. So that is what is given to us. Now if, if these are the two x intercepts, you can write quadratic equation as y equals to a times x minus 3 times x minus 7. To find the value of a, we can use the point given to us y value is minus 4, a times x value is 1, 1 minus 3 times 1 minus 7, right? So that gives you a times minus 2 times minus 6, which is 12 plus 12. So we get 12a on the right side. To find the value of a, we'll divide minus 4 by 12. So a is equals to minus 1 over 3, correct? Now since a is minus 1 over 3, we can always write this here. So we get our equation as okay, first let me write the equation right here. y equals to minus 1 over 3. I am substituting a as minus 1 over 3 in the equation. x minus 3 times x minus 7, right? Now to write it in standard form, we need to expand it. So I'd like you to expand this and complete the question. So multiply x's together, apply the distributor x square minus 7x and then minus 3x, that will make it minus 10x and then sum will be plus 21 and everything should be multiplied by minus 1 over 3. So we can get y equals to minus 1 over 3 and when you multiply you get x square and then minus 3x minus 7x will give you minus 10x right and minus 3 times minus 7 is plus 21 right so that becomes our equation and we'll open the bracket to write this in standard form there is less space here so I'm just squeezing it in right let me write in different color so we get minus 1 over 3x squared, right? And minus and minus becomes plus. So plus 10 over 3x. And minus 1 over 3 times 21 will be minus 7. So that becomes our answer. So we say our answer is minus 1 over 3x plus 10 over 3 minus 7, right? So i like you to do this question on your own and then check with my answer. That would be a good idea. I hope you understand the steps involved in it. Thank you and all the best.